this needs to stop. So guys, I wanted to comment on, on this old Candace Owens and, Kim, and Kimberly uh, kick a uh, few. I, I, I'm sorry, I don't know how to pronounce her last name. Uh, Kimberly Klakik. Uh, if you, I wanted to talk talk about it and why Candace Owens and Kimberly need to stop this right now, because this whole feud started about you know June, about Juneteenth. Juneteenth is a it's a, it's a waste of time. They only did that to to, to appease to the misinformed. Pretty much, pretty much, uh, woke black people who don't who who, who don't even realize that 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 all this was just was just was just uh, virtual signaling. It was a waste of time, people. If they really wanted to make this a holiday, they would have did this back 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 in 2010 or 2009, one one of those years. But they but they did but they did it in 2021 because they want to keep a lot of black people a lot of black people voting blue. People with common sense realize this. But this whole this whole thing that can't like that uh, apparently Kimberly said something that that, can't, that Candace Owens didn't like. She called she called out Ken, uh, Candace Owens about the, about the whole uh, June uh, June taint thing, and Candace Owens says a lot a lot a lot of people a lot of black people are brainwashed. Which they which they are. I'm not going to deny that they are brainwashed. And Ki and Kimberly said. Believe it or not, many in, in Black America are very aware of the fight is classicism, rather racism. Unfortunately, the loudest mouths with the largest platform represent the majority. They might come a shot to you, but because of your lack of, of engagement with black with black people, apparently Owens did not reply to the tweet. And Kimberly explained to a Twitter user who later claimed that Kenneth's grip is too strong that she deleted her post as she as she decided I would just prove it rather than talk about it on Twitter. So this so this feud happened with the with, with the whole Juneteenth thing. Candace always uh claimed that black that black people are too uh are too brainwashed. Kimberly says they're not, and then you and then you have this stu this stupid escalation going on about who's about who's right and who's wrong between two conservative women. Two black conservative women. It does not freaking matter. My problem is Candace Owens kind of dropped the ball with this one. Here's the thing. I like Candace Owens. I like I like I like Kimberly. They both seem like they want they they want to uh, help out the black community. But Kimberly is more for running for Congress, and Candace Owens is is is, is just a speaker. She may she may be on the Daily Wire. She may be this whole Brexit thing. But as far as actually trying to be someone who puts poli who puts policies in place to help out the black community, that's more Kimberly. So this whole feud. That was going on, and Candace Owens uh, trying to uh, place trying to place out Kimberly's personal information. Yeah, trying to put uh, Kimberly's personal information out on Twitter. It's just a waste of time. We uh, see you don't you don't see the the the, the people in the Democrat Party fight fight like this. Why? It's it, it's always the Republicans, especially Black Republicans, doing this. You guys need 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 to stop. Shut up. And that and, and actually work together on this. If you guys are really trying to take, uh, really trying to get more more people to, to vote Republican, this is not a good way to do it. Y'all y'all both seem very smart, but this whole but but this whole feud that that you got going on is just a waste of freaking time. It's a waste of time. Kimberly, you what you you voted for? You was a. Uh, I'm sorry. You was one. You, you you was running running for Congress, and uh, I'm sorry. You 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 was you was running for a for a Congress seat in De in Baltimore. You, apparently, you, you said in one of your videos that you got that you got that no Republican in Baltimore has got has ever gotten over fourteen thousand votes. But you on your first run, you got fourteen thousand. That's progress. Keep doing that. Keep doing what you're doing. Trump uh, trying to send a message. You should get Candace Owens. No, yeah, yeah. Candace Owens should be helping you instead of degrading you. That's the main problem here. It for uh, for for Candace Owens to say more more black people need need to need to be a voice or need to step up to the Republican to the Republican Party and then tra and then trash Kimberly. It's not it's not a good look. It's it's quite obvious who 
it's quite it's quite obvious when you try to do stuff like that. You're not you're not sending the message that that you that you guys are, are trying to stick together. It seems like you, you guys are trying to create two separate parties. And we we've had enough of that. We've had we've had enough of that. Is it is either you guys need to work together, or you, or, or or one of y'all needs, needs to keep keep on doing, uh, you keep on keep on doing, uh, the Daily Wire shows, and and one of them need, needs to go back into like running running for Congress and get and get into the White House, so he can get so they can drain the swamp. But Candace Owens, if you if you actually are trying to work for, work for president. This is this is not the the way to do it. If you if you do watch if you do watch this video, call call me out all you want. But you need you need to stop back bashing on people who are trying to help the black community get them away from the Democrat Party because this is not a good look for you. Especially if there are some black people who who are, who are trying to look for an, an alternative from the Democrats because they, because they because some of them know they've been lied to for all these years. They just don't have an alternative because mainstream media will, will point will point to this party as the party of slavery, when it was actually the media, no, yeah, when it was actually the Democrats. So this few needs to stop. I was I, I would say the same thing that I said in my Brandon Tatum and, and Amazing Lucas video. Stop it. Stop it. Work together. Actually, actually have a, a civil debate, no interrupting, and try to. Figure out, figure out a way how how, how to get more uh, black people to to wake up from the di from the Democrat narrative. Stop with the black on black violence or the black or the black on black uh, altercations. You guys, let me know what, what, what you think in the comments below. If you guys like what I'm saying, like, comment, subscribe, share the video. I will see you on the next one. Peace.